Many passages in the Old Testament speak of Jesus, the Son of God, even calling him the Son of God. And he says concerning his Son, that's the first thing he calls Jesus. Secondly, Jesus, then Christ, and then Lord. He has a fourfold name. His emphasis here is that this gospel of God is not a belief system, as all religions are, but this gospel is a person. First of all, it's concerning his son. So as relates to God the Father, Jesus is the son. As relates to man, he was a mortal who lived upon this earth and was baby Jesus, the son of Mary, Jesus, the one the Bible said whose name is Emmanuel, God with us, who will, it said, save his people from their sins. Concerning his son, Jesus Christ. Christ was a word the Jews were familiar with, and so must the Romans have been. It was the word for Messiah, the anointed. So he was as related to the Father, the Son, as related to man. He was Jesus the Savior, and he was Christ, the anointed of God, to an office as high priest. And he was our Lord. He's Lord. That is, he deserves our devotion. He's the one to whom we bow down.